Doctors say masking up is one of the keys to keeping our hospital system in check, even as our cases rise. Which is the concern now, especially in Hillsborough, our hardest hit county in Tampa Bay? The rate of people testing positive has skyrocketed the last two weeks, 11.1%. But look at the COVID-19 hospital admissions in Hillsborough County. The average per day is trending up. Hospitalizations up 25% in a week. ICU admissions, they jumped 10% over the same time frame. Across the Bay, hospitals are starting to revisit some of their surge plans. But as 10 Tampa Bay reporter Josh Sidorowitz explains, it's not the growing number of young people testing positive that doctors are worried about ending up in the ICU. So first, current capacity remains OK, but hospital leaders are worried about who the more and more young people who are testing positive, but likely not getting sick from COVID are unknowingly passing it on to. We are at a place right now where if these young people who are getting virus begin to transmit to even a small percent of people who are older, we're going to see that uh, escalation of healthcare resource utilization go up very quickly. Across the Bay, medical leaders are trying to make sense of the shift they have seen in the past week. As more of us try to go about our lives again, the virus is spreading. And now ICU admissions at TGH, for example, have doubled in this past week. Hospitals are once again reviewing surge plans developed months ago when this pandemic started. Most of the cases we were bringing in Tampa General, I would say when I was working in the um, emergency department COVID area, uh, in uh, late April and most of May were really people we kind of expected to, to be positive. I'll tell you, last night I admitted five patients to the COVID unit. These patients were not from group homes. One of the patients was a young man in his 40s who had no other medical problems and he was very sick. So we, we are seeing a change there. The other aspect of this, doctors say, is what increasing community spread of the virus can mean for our health care workers, who are not only now balancing COVID patients, but increased testing duties on top of quote unquote normal operations. The more transmission in cases we have in the community, um, the more hospital staff members may become positive. And so you have workforce implications and our hospitals are telling us that they're becoming concerned about their capacity if this continues. And to give you a better idea of that increased workload they're already dealing with, Dr. Wilson said in the decade he's worked in the ER at TGH, on their busiest day, they had around 320 patients. This past Friday, he said they had nearly that many, 305 in just the testing area. They had 520 people in the ER.